Hello, I am Crispy Jelly, and this is the second video to my YouTube channel. So, <laughs> this video was coming a little shorter than, or like, uh, it's coming a little sooner than I expected, because I I found some time uh, hidden in my closet. So, I just thought I'd pull that out and use it up on this. So that's nice. Um, good extra content. Um. So I'm doing a lot of settling in, you know, because I just moved to Florida, by the way. Hey, Floridians, I'm a Florida man now. I'm ready to wrestle an alligator. Uh, and so, yeah, so that's fun. It's hot. It's just lots of palm trees. It's an interesting experience. Uh, as one of the interesting experiences, they have giant grasshoppers. I'll put in a picture that my brother found. Pretty cool. And so, yeah, so that's how things have been going. Um, I also kind of want to talk about my introduction video a little bit, because <laughs> for any of the 12 people who may have watched it, there hasn't been a whole lot of progress. That video is a mess. It's kind of just like satire. It's like 45 minutes long, it's full of pauses, and the quality's not great. Something I noticed is that the music was way too loud, while my voice is way too soft, so I'm going to try and correct that. I don't have a very good mic. So I'm just kind of working with what I got. Um, but I also refuse to edit anymore. <laughs> I refuse to edit anymore because that's my introduction. And that's that I probably used it for this video unless I forgot, which I hope I didn't. Um, <laughs> and yeah, so that's it. That's my first video. I'm probably not going to change anything. And so, yeah. So um, today I'm going to be playing. Let me just move my script. I'm going to be playing. A Five Nights at Freddy's fan game. Now, I know this genre is kind of oversaturated. For those who have not heard of Five Nights at Freddy's, it is a game based off of a pizzeria having animatronics that are haunted with souls, and they try to kill you. And there's, like, cameras and action of that nature. Who hasn't heard of Five Nights at Freddy's? Come on now. Um, and it's a bit cheesy, if you will, because, you know, many, many people play... Uh, FNAF fan games, but this is one that I've had on my computer a while just because and I think I played these two in the past, but uh, yeah, because they're little stars So I think I've beaten those two I'm gonna be replaying them in this video because I don't remember anything this one I've had this for like two years and so it's called the webs of cogs and oil This guy got a spooky title um, And yeah, I'm just gonna be playing this because I like FNAF fan games <laughs> Again, they're oversaturated, but you know what? I had it on my computer, and I'm going to be playing it, and that's that. I have other games on my computer, but I don't know what <laughs> they are. So, And the my YouTube channel is probably going to have a lot of variety, such as things like this. It could be like single-player creepy games. It could be story-based, or we could be playing GTA with the guys, with the bros. So you never know what you're going to find. I don't know what I'm going to find. It's all to be decided as time goes on. So this is just something I thought I'd do as a little extra content shortly after the launch of my channel. Um, yeah, so let's start with the corpse. You are, trap you are trapped in a walk-in freezer. The temperature is repeatedly getting lower. Do not let the thermostat behind you go below 30 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, I forgot to say the, the, the corpse. In front of you are three lights and a hand crank, which powers these lights. The higher the temperature, the faster the lights will go out, and the more difficult it would be to power them with the crank. The corpse moves through the darkness. Do not let all the lights go out. Press any key or button to continue. I'm going to press a button. Ooh. Spooky. Which way am I cranking? Oh, I gotta keep my mouse. Okay, what's this do? Don't I need to keep it higher? <gasps> oh, oh. It's like a crank, crank, crank. Also, I kept my mouse cursor on here. <laughs> Why is it not? Okay, I kept my mouse cursor on here so you can kind of see my. If I get like jump scared, the struggle, or you know, just kind of a bit of my reaction, and like, 
and what actions I need to take. I can't see. I can't. Oh no! 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 there okay I ooh. I don't have very good headphones either I'm just using like earbuds oh that sounds a lot worse oh no okay oh that sounds so much more intimidating I don't know I have a hand crank charger, and I know for a fact that uh, no 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 no. I don't think. Am I dead? Is this already dead? Oh. Okay, I'm a little less scared because I don't know for sure if I'm already dead by that point or not. Also, I don't. I can't seem to crank very fast. The the, the click seems very finicky, and I don't know if that's like me or the game. Let me see. Is there like a sensitivity on particles? Oh. Uh. Delete save data. Start. Uh. I'm gonna hold X just that way. There we go. Just that way, like, whatever I had saved, now you know that, like, if I beat it, I actually beat it. Rather than having the two that I may have beaten in the past. I don't remember. Yeah, there we go. Now they're all clear. I want to beat this one, but I also think due to technical difficulties, I don't know if it's like a skill issue. I think maybe it's just like a technique about it, where you got to get with a certain... I'm not very skilled with a mouse. I don't use, I don't use mice, computer mice very often. I'm not a huge PC gamer. Good thing these muscles are well developed. I'm good at cranking. <laughs> no. You will not eat me, corpse monster. I'm unstoppable. I'm in a freezer. These are my prime working conditions. Ask anyone where I used to work. Shout out to all my friends from Wet and Wild. Eh. I used to work at a water park, guys. It's really cool. Didn't they say this was a freezer? I think it was a lock-in freezer. Wait, how long do I have to... Oh, it's a time limit. How low does... How low am I allowed to get that to go? Oh man, I'm gripping the microphone because I'm it's a hold one, so I'm using only one hand. <laughs> uh, usually it takes two. No, sorry. <laughs> How low can I let that go? Cause it says like the higher the hotter it is, the more the electricity goes out. But it's also like I don't know how low in, it goes before I start freezing. So I'm gonna try and keep it uh Okay, okay, so you're not dead. You're not dead if it goes into, like, the pitch black. You just gotta be fast. Okay, so I'm gonna try and keep it at the even 40 at this point. Just because I don't really have any other... <sighs> up, up, up. You know what? 30 it is. Okay. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. You're not so tough. You're in a freezer. But if I punch you, you chatter. Ooh. Who gets trapped in a walk-in freezer? Why is there a corpse in a walk-in freezer? 
I'm, I'm starting to question the situation. You know what? Just crank. <gasps> ah, yes! Okay, survived! I'm, I'm a survivor, yeah! Alright, corpse. Not too bad. That's kind of... That one was kind of rough. That one takes a lot of cranking, but luckily, I'm a very skilled cranker. <laughs> oh, man. How many jokes of these is it going to take me to get demonetized? Not that I'm monetized, of course, but, you know. Alright, next up is the trickster. This one was not checked off, so I don't know if I've ever done this one. You're equipped with a flashlight. Oh, wait. <coughs> i got to get into my announcement mode. <coughs> the trickster. You are equipped with a flashlight with a very limited battery. Use this sparingly, only to stop the trickster in his path once you hear him running around the room. Oh, it's audio-based. Oh, interesting. Do not let him run beyond the border of your screen. However, don't be- Oh, I clicked! I clicked! Oh, frick! Don't be fooled by the- Oh, no. Oh, no. Hey, wait. Oh, no. What? Hey. Oh no, I only have one hand. I can't record very well because I gotta use this. I gotta use this hand to hit the control, otherwise. That's horrifying. audio-based ones. Okay, that's unfortunate. I thought I got him. Ha! Ah, okay, that one. Man, I, I don't like that one. I don't like audio-based ones. That one was like... Ooh. Also, I noticed that the star is not filled in. I wonder if there's like a hard mode. In which case... If there is a hard mode... Uh, I might do that in a future episode. I don't know. I like I like doing YouTube videos according to fun rather than like content. So I don't know how many series I'm gonna end up doing. I think I'll do FNAF VR though, because I really like that game. That game's just fun in general. You know what? Let me finish reading the description because I never did okay. <coughs> uh you are equipped with a flashlight with a very limited battery. Use this sparingly only to stop the trickster in his path when you get him running across the room. Do not let him run beyond the border of your screen. However, do not be immediately fooled once you hear footsteps where there are two jack-in-the-boxes which mimic his sounds on either side of the room. And lastly, remember not to be fooled by his sounds. That would have been helpful from the beginning because I almost died like three times because I forgot about the fact that he could just come at you without warning. That's what she said. Sorry. I should not apologize. These jokes are wonderful. I'm going to play this game again. Let's go. I'm gonna stop talking.
why? Because I said that. One minute. Thank goodness. Nuts! I was so close! Well, sort of, but gosh darn it, I, I thought I checked the left. Ah! Okay, whatever. Ah! Okay. I think... I'm gonna give it one more shot. I'll try the trickster one more time, and then I'll take a break. If I don't beat him, I'm gonna try. I think I can. Because it's not that hard. It's about the system. You just gotta be fast about checking and stuff. Okay. Words. Okay. I don't remember when he starts doing things. I need a mic stand. Oh, oh. It's getting faster. No! No, I saw him, but uh, it doesn't it doesn't count the back end of him as ah. Uh. Okay. One more try. I can do it. I know I can. It's not that hard. I just I just need to go faster. Okay. First 40 seconds seem to be very little. Yeah, he speeds up as time goes on.
it doesn't count the back end. Yes, yes, yes! I tried to just keep. Oh, I just tried to keep my light on him at like for the, like five seconds, and I ran out of battery. I thought I was doomed. Oh, okay. All right, the corpse and the trickster. All right, two left. The demon and the machine. All right, we're going in order from left to right, just because I, just because I. That's. You know, whatever. All right, whatever. The demon. You have three things to tend to. On your right are three candles. You must keep them all lit to keep the demon at bay. On your left is one candle. You must keep this lit, or else the servant will come to blow out the demon's candles. On your far left is a pentagram that will progressively grow brighter. Make sure that you keep it dark. Press any button. Or, what? you know. All right. Interesting. Okay, candles. How do I keep them? Okay, for the candles, I assume I just click. Because if they're out, then I click, then they light some. Uh, but what about the pentagram? It just says make sure you keep it dark. Do I click it? Okay. Uh, there's a pentagram. Do I click? Okay, so I don't need to be worried anything for now except the pentagram and these three. Or no. Wait. No. I gotta... I gotta be worried about all three. So do I click it or do I... Oh. Okay. I think I click and hold. I'm... Oh. Stop. Don't do that. I don't know if I click rapidly or click and hold. Okay. I hold. Okay. Stop. Don't do that. Don't you dare. Okay. Don't do that. Stop. Go away. It looks like Balloon Boy. Which makes me hate him more. Oh, I hate this music. Actually, I kind of like it, but... It's not really music. <laughs> Although I can't speak. Everyone knows... Well, everyone who's watched my first video knows my musicking experience. Oh no, those go out quick. <laughs> How fast is Balloon Boy over there? Because he seems to be real fast. Stop. Okay, this pentagram is becoming a problem as I need to flip to the... To this here. It's very predictable, though. Oh, no. Whenever I miss a click, that worries me. Because it's like, these go out real fast. Huh. Okay. Was that, was that like a painting of a witch in the background? 
I don't know what that is. Oh, the pentagram. The pentagram. Okay, only stop. Don't dare. No, stop. Ah, stop. Don't you dare. Stop. No. Okay, pentagram. All three of those are out. Stop. Stop. Go away. Oh, I hate this. Okay, pentagram is the least of my concerns. Not really. I need to get, take care of that. Oh, no, it's... All three are out, and yet... Ah! No! No, no, no. Stop! Don't you dare. I dare you. Oh, 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 I didn't even notice the time. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, that sucks. Okay, that one's very stressful. That one's not as like... Okay, so this one's stressful because it's a back and forth similar to that. In that like you flip and you have to you have to wind up and then you see the flickering behind you, which you know it's getting closer, but you don't know how much closer. Um, and then you turn around and it's like, oh, I gotta wind. This one, this one's bad because it's all audio based. So either you hear nothing, which means you could be creeping closer, or he's going to the left or right. So that one's not too bad, but it's like, it sucks because if he jump scares you, it's going to be loud and blaring, especially if you don't notice it. This one is very stressful because you have like five different things you're focusing on at the same time. All right. The machine. Last one. You are in a building that has been put on lockdown with the machine. You must unlock all doors within the building using your monitor and escape by unlocking the final door behind you. However, be sure to keep an eye on the machine. If you aren't looking, she'll progressively get closer. If she is too close, she won't move back. You are, equ Wait. You are equipped with a taser for when she gets too close. Using Use it as sparingly as possible. You have four minutes and 30 seconds to... All right, so this one's different. Instead of the time limit meaning, oh, you're done, yeah, you've escaped. This one's like, if you don't escape within this time, you're dead. Okay. This one has a odd description. I'm not quite sure what to expect with this one. Oh. Oh, it's, oh, it's a FNAF one. Interesting. Control to use taser. What do these do? Oh. 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 So she slowly gets closer if I'm not watching. Okay. Okay, I see how it works. So I need, oh, yeah. I need to slowly watch her. Make sure that I don't... Okay. Up. Is it still up? Yes. Okay. I see. And because I hold my mic, I need to... <laughs> I'm... Okay. I'm going to have to put down my mic, guys. I can't commentate during this one. One down. Ah, uh, uh, I didn't know what was happening. Okay, 
So what happens if she gets too close, she just starts banging. How many doors do I have? Oh, there's... Oh, no. Okay. Oh, this might... I might not win. Frick. Nuts. Uh oh. Wait, is that circus baby? Wait a minute. There's no sign. I think it just like blinks twice when it's right. Well... Oh. Well, that's not great. Uh, okay, that one. That one's a bit hard. Oh no. I don't know how long I've been recording. I don't know if I want... Uh, I don't, there's something, I think maybe, okay, I have a theory, is that the more I use the taser, the more glitches there are in the system. That's a theory, I have no idea how accurate that is. Alright, I'm going for it again. Doing way better than last time, guys. This is going so much better. I think my theory was correct.
open. Oh! It's like a safe. Oh, nuts. Okay. Okay. Get back. Damn it! Get back! You will not eat my brains today! Or wear my skin as a suit. You will not skin suit me. I'm not your persona. Get back. I will not let you be a. I don't know. Ah, I'm free! I'm free from this building I was inexplicably trapped in. <gasps> and that's it, guys. Thank you for playing A Web of Cogs and Oil. Alright, let's check out the extras just to see. Oh, okay, it's cool. Alright, sweet. So now we get to look at the characters. The trickster. Alright. The corpse. Very nice. What's this line about? I don't know what that's about. The demon. I didn't get a real close look. Of, I got a close look at his face. So that one would be the most FNAF-ish other than... The machine, which is obviously a uh, circus baby. That one's absolutely circus baby. It did say it did say that this is a FNAF um, fan game, though. So you know, uh, and that's it. No secret characters. Environments. Uh, there's the, the tricksters, the, the fridge, the demon. With uh, it is Balloon Boy and Circus Baby. Man, that one. This one was the hardest. Concept art. <laughs> Tricks. Oh, that's cute. Hey, it kind of looks like Larry. Guys, you know Larry. He is my, he's my cutesy side character for my channel. It's Larry. He's my profile picture. Check him out if you don't know. Uh, Larry, nice. I mean, sorry, Tricks, Trickster, Demon. That's kind of like like a werewolf. A web of cocks. <laughs> Reject logo design. I like it. It's got like web for web. It's got cogs for cog. And oil is drippy like oil. Makes, uh, excuse me, makes sense. You got Trickster over here sitting on his stool. Reminds me of Plush Trap. Ooh. Is that even, is that even concept art? That's just the design they went with. Behind scenes. Oh, that's cool. I like being able to see all this stuff. Because we actually get to see kind of like all of it. It's kind of interesting. Horrifying glitch. <gasps> I will not find that glitch. Horrifying glitch too. <laughs> when you get two at once. I may have gotten that at some point in my video. Because I think I, I thought I saw I did. Maybe I was just being paranoid. I don't know. As I look through. If I find it. I'll cut it. Cut. So you're returning to menu. All right, well, guys, that's gonna be all for uh, the web of cogs and oil. I hope you've enjoyed. Um, if you liked this video, I'm not doing the stupid smash like. That's not what I do. Um, you can like if you want, though. It doesn't do anything, but you know, it's a thumbs up. So I don't know how many of you are gonna watch this video, but I just thought, you know what? It's fun. I like playing these games, and. I thought I'd post some more content since I was available. So yeah, uh, see you guys next time. I don't have an outro saying I hit the extras button by accident. <laughs>